Love, Marriage, and Temptation. My name is Dr. Amy Botwinick for WorkingMomLifeline.com, and this is for WomenMovingOn.com. Had another trip to New York, went with a girlfriend that I haven't seen in a really long time, most of which were married, going to dinner, having drinks, the whole thing, and found myself in a bar with a friend of mine who's really attractive. And uh, as she is going to get drinks for us, she turns around to give it to us, and she basically almost bumps into this amazing-looking man from India and uh, lives in England, now in, in New York. And she was just really taken back by him. It was funny to watch the interaction from a close distance. She's married happily with children and was very upfront about this, but they had this internal this chemistry that was still bouncing off the walls. And he was very much a gentleman. Um, I'm kind of standing, kind of talking, not talking. I stupid thing. What do I say? The first thing I say, I see an Indian man. And what do I say? So, have you seen it? So I'm a slum dog millionaire. So we got into this whole discussion about the movie and about life, and it got really heavy. And it turns out that this guy is a Sikh, and he was just so spiritual and beautiful, amazing man. And I mean, I understood why she was Gaga, and she was also trying to be very reserved. But he kind of was like, you know what? I really like to see you again. You know, I know that you're married, but you're on vacation. And he was really working on just sitting there, like, oh my God, what is she gonna do? And she was very smart and very funny and you know she's like look I'm, I'm very happily married I really am flattered by your attention I enjoyed speaking with you and yes I would love to but you know no thank you please go away um, and then she said something like I hope to see you in another life and he laughed and it was fine and it, it ended and he uh, as he was leaving he gave her a wink and left and she's just like dying on the inside I mean I could see her knees were like buckling and she was just turning into mush and she said look you know what yes he was hot did I feel like chemistry yeah is it worth ruining what I have at home absolutely not I know what I have and I'm sure my husband gets hit on all the time but we both have a reality check that we always make sure that no matter what we're not going to harm what we've built together so many years with so much energy that's been put into it not just between us but also our kids too important so it was really nice to have uh, you know see a woman that is just acknowledging yeah there's temptation out there and I am attracted to other people but I'm not going there I choose to not go there I choose to protect my marriage it's like yes yeah. so it was kind of fun being a fly on the wall with that so keep that in mind uh, relationships are hard and it's a choice you make to protect them and the ones we love my name is dr. Amy Botwinick with women moving on.com and this is for working mom lifeline.com